I guess it was a little over a month ago, but to open the field in Hawthorne that day. Um, talk about what that was like for you and what that meant and uh, being a part of that. It's, it's mind-boggling, you know, just to see a home for soccer in my hometown. You know, a lot of kids that are growing up, they have a place to go to have fun with their friends and, and stay out of trouble and just have fun and play the beautiful game, you know. So I, I feel like it's made a huge impact. And I've already seen various videos um, via social media of multiple people and multiple kids playing on these pitches, you know. It's three beautiful fields and, and kids are using it every single day. It definitely did have an impact and we had a class write uh, some letters to you. Oh wow. Uh, kids Look who've used the field. <laughs> Nice. If you'd want to open them and take a look and, and maybe read through some of them. Yeah, of course, of course. All right. So, I mean, our first letter is from uh, Emma. Um, Emma Limon. And, I mean, just reading through it, it starts out, Dear Jossie's Artist, Hello, my name is Emma. I'm eight years old, and I'm in the third grade, and I go to St. Joseph's. I live in Inglewood. You're the best player in the LA Galaxy. I am the girl who is your biggest fan because I know that there might be a boy who is your biggest fan. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. I love soccer too. It is very fun and sometimes challenging. I really like the new field for uh, futsal. You made the Memorial Park nicer and prettier. Wow, that's, that's beautiful to hear, you know, with all the murals that they painted on, at Memorial Park with the fields, you know, that park has transformed dramatically since those new pitches came in. Um, our next letter is from Jason. And uh, Jason, you start off your letter by, by explaining and telling me that you go to St. Joseph's uh, School. The school is in Hawthorne. The park you cleaned up is near my grandma's house. When you opened the futsal field, I went. I'm glad you attended when we opened the, the facility. You know, the, you're a part of history in Hawthorne. <laughs> um, I'm thankful that you cleaned up the park. I like watching the LA Galaxy play. I'm very happy you love watching us play. I hope you can make it out to a ton of games. And um, do you like playing with the LA Galaxy? Um, Jason, to answer your question, I, I love playing with the LA Galaxy. You know, I grew up watching, uh, you know, uh, some of the older guys play who are, who are club legends. And uh, my dad used to always take me to games whenever he'll, he'll get tickets, you know. Uh, so I always grew up a huge fan of the LA Galaxy and it's, it's crazy I achieved my dream by being a part of, of, of the team, you know. Um, your next question is, what is it like playing for the U.S. men's national team? And uh, it's an amazing feeling playing for the U.S. men's national team, you know. You're representing your country, and uh, it's a lot of great American soccer players, but just to be selected out of all the, the soccer players who can play for the national team, it's, 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 it's mind-boggling, you know, and it's very motivating because I always want to work harder and, uh, and always get called up to future camps. And um, I thank you for, for writing this letter, Jason. I truly appreciate this. And um, our last letter is from Ivana Gonzalez. And uh, you start off your letter by saying, Hello, Jossie's artist. My name is Ivana. I'm in the third grade. I go to St. Joseph's School. My school is in Hawthorne. Thank you for fixing Memorial Park. You're more than welcome. And uh, I always say thank uh, the LA Galaxy Foundation as well and uh, Chevrolet FC you know, because they, they really came together and, and made that, that part possible. Um, you go on to tell me that you uh, live in Hawthorne and uh, you always play on the soccer fields and I'm glad you play on the soccer fields, Ivana. And I, I hope you always have fun, you know. Um, a question you ask is, uh, what do you like about Hawthorne? The thing I really like about Hawthorne is uh, my friends from Hawthorne. You know, growing up in Hawthorne, um, a lot of family have a lot of kids, so uh, I always had a ton of friends and you know, I feel like soccer is a language itself and if you're playing soccer at the park, kids will walk by and just come and start playing with you, you know. I remember multiple times I didn't even know anybody, but I'll just go start kicking the ball with them, you know. So it really, uh, it really helped me um, just meet new, new friends and that's what I love about Hawthorne. People are always so welcoming um, and, and it's very diverse. Uh, your next question is, uh, do you like to play soccer? Uh, I don't think I like to play soccer. I love playing soccer. You know, I always have fun every time I, I touch a soccer ball or even watch soccer on TV or even play soccer video games. Um, I love the sport, you know, and I think that's what drives me. Um, your next question goes on to say, I wish we can visit you or you can visit us. Um, I think we're definitely gonna see each other pretty soon. <laughs> Are you nervous to play soccer? I'll be nervous because there's a lot of people so uh, 
you know, I don't get nervous, you know, because uh, you, you practice and you train, and that preparation is supposed to prepare you for the game. So I don't really get nervous in that aspect, but I kind of get tunnel vision. So I only see players on the field. I don't really, uh, I forget about the crowd once that whistle blows. It's, it's weird, you know, but um, I just focus on just my opponents. That's the player in front of me when I'm playing and, uh, and also my teammates, you know. Thank you guys for writing me all these letters. I can't wait to read them all and I can't wait to meet all of you. In fact, I'd like to invite Mr. Santos third grade class from St. Joseph's School to the game this weekend against San Jose.